second. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If you are regularly watching our videos, you might have come across the Force Feedback Gaming Setup Build Series. If not, you can check out this particular playlist. I'll leave a link in the description box. In the part second video, I have shown the list of components used for building Force Feedback Steering Wheel. In order to measure the steering rotation and the direction, I have used industrial high precision 600 ppr rotary encoder. This encoder itself cost around 1500 rupees. Considering the same point, I have got many comments from the viewers. Instead of this expensive encoder, can we use the cheap encoder that is usually available for Arduino projects and also costs around 50 to 60 rupees. Even I'm curious to know whether it will work or not. So in this video, I'll give it a try. Considering the same circuit, which we have used before, I'll be replacing the 600 ppr encoder with the smaller one. According to the circuit, I have removed this industrial encoder and mounted the smaller one using the same pulleys. So as of now, the software is detecting the wheel rotation and the degrees are changing. Physically it's working, but I can feel there is more lag and it's very less responsive. If I try the same with the industrial encoder, it's very responsive. And also it is detecting the slight movements. So this difference is because of the resolution of the encoders. This expensive encoders generate more pulses for a small movement in the shaft. Whereas the cheap encoders generate less number of pulses for the same amount of movement on the shaft. So this is where the software doesn't get enough data in less time and creates a lag. I'll also give it a try in the game. truck simulator when vehicle is driving slowly I could somehow manage but as soon as I increase the speed I'm feeling difficult to control this is because of its low resolution as I've explained before In this game you could somehow try but if you choose any racing games definitely it will be difficult to control. That's all for this video guys. I hope I have cleared most of your doubts. Still if you have any questions let me know in the comment section below. Also make sure you subscribe and follow us on Instagram for more upgrades on our gaming rig.
thank you for watching i'll be back in another interesting one